Okay, roll sound. So this is the video crew setting up. So who the fuck is everybody? I'm Anthony, and Chris Weiser, Chris, and I'm Charlie. He right now shooting with the epic camera, which is the same camera that they shot Spider-Man. from Hourly Management. I mean, it was famous last words. Not just me, though, Brian. He's a guy named Brian Judge who helps me out, too. You're saying, don't stop. I'm really going to get to this time. What are you doing? Just going to All right, you guys ready? Hello, I'm Bob Hell, Hellmaidens.com, and I'm sitting here with... Famous Last Words! Hey, I'm the singer and screamer. I'm Ethan, I play lead guitar. Tyler, I'm rhythm guitar. Jesse, I play bass. Craig and I play drums. So when did you guys get into town? We got into town a couple days ago. Yeah? yeah? Saturday. So why did you guys shoot Baltimore and film your video in? It's a fucking awesome city. He's like, we're gonna do it at the Rams Head Live, but we're like, we don't know what that is. <laughs> Months ago, Bourbon Street. Bourbon Street, yeah, that's where it was. And uh, we had a fucking great time playing that show. We love this city, we love people. It's great hospitality. Saturday morning, we left at like 4 a.m. I drove 15 hours straight to get here. 15 hours straight to get here. You suck, dude. <laughs> <laughs> you know how tours are, testosterone's off the roof. A chick in this band would be a bad idea. <laughs> so on the road are you guys taking up a lot of chicks? Bartender! Yeah. JT, do you pick up lots of chicks on the road? <laughs> the answer is yes. Yes. So what the fuck you guys been doing the past couple nights? Oh, getting drunk. I look at my text message, it's like a naked chick. And I was like, what the fuck? And then I got two more, so three nudies, all within two hours of waking up. You're a man. Did you save any of them, though? <laughs> <laughs> you just have them. Where'd you guys record your EP at? Uh, at Chango Studios in Orlando, Florida, with Cameron Mandel. Bartenders, right? So. <laughs> yeah, that works out You get a pregnant bartender, you'll get some bar milk, <laughs> won't you? <laughs> There's nothing wrong with banging pregnant girls. I do it all the time. <laughs> this is the best interview ever. <laughs> yeah. Yeah.
that your ashtray shoe? Yeah. Nice. I got it from him. <laughs> he puts it right back on. <laughs> that big guy went on stage and she took that squirt gun filled with blood and stuck it up his ass. You guys are fucking drinking and smoking and shit. And all these other bands are all trying to be straight edge. <laughs> Machine comes up into her shit and fucking pulls her lips open and they fucking shove like 10 inches of blood in <laughs> yeah, I mean, what's with all this pussy shit nowadays with this fucking music? <laughs> well, it started in like 08, all of a sudden Christian hardcore was awesome. Was that shit legal on stage? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I was just gonna say, they got great publicity, and then all of a sudden the bands weren't Christian anymore. Which makes it publicity stock. Like, yeah, and I'm just wearing underwear now. <laughs> I'm, I'm puking <laughs> as I'm texting. <laughs> and I just stick my phone back in my fucking underwear. <laughs> And it stayed in there too, it didn't fall or anything, it was just right on my balls. <laughs>